Welcome to Sheet Leveler. I'm Lee, and I'm here to help you learn how to use Excel in a quick and easy way, thanks to our digestible video tutorials. Today, we're going to have a closer look at the function Roundup. Rounding numbers is something we can do in various ways. We can round up, round down, or simply round them according to the general mathematical rule. In this tutorial, we'll focus on the Roundup function, which will help you round numbers in a specific way. For more information on the other functions, check out the tutorial links in the description below. Let's round up the values in column B to various numbers of decimal places, or to make them whole numbers. Click on cell C3, then type in the equal sign, followed by the roundup function. Next, begin with an opening bracket and include two items. Select cell B3, which contains the number we wish to round up. Enter a comma and type in the second value, specifying the number of decimal places desired in the result. To round up to one decimal place, type 1, close the parentheses, then press Enter. In C3, Excel will display the rounded up result of B3 to one decimal place. To round a number to two decimal places, just use 2 in the function. The number will then be rounded up accordingly. You can round any number up to the desired number of decimal places by using positive numbers such as 1, 2, 3, and so on. Let's proceed. To round a value up to the nearest whole number, enter a zero in the function. Excel will then round up the original value to the nearest whole number. Like so, we're not done yet. To round up a number to the nearest tens or hundreds, you can use negative numbers in the formula to move left from the decimal point. Ensure that the minus sign is included when entering the number in parentheses. Let's look at a few examples. To round the number up to the nearest 10, simply enter minus 1 into the formula and the result will be yours. To round the number up to the nearest 100, simply enter minus 2 in Excel and the calculation will be performed right away. And that's the gist of rounding up in Excel. If you'd like to learn how to use other functions like round or round down, watch the rest of the video tutorials on rounding numbers by Sheet Leveler. If you found this tutorial helpful, give the video a like and hit that subscribe button to join our online community to learn to excel like a boss. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.